Indonesia's Muslim Council is set to issue a ruling on whether a COVID-19 vaccine is halal, as many fear public resistance unless it is proven to be permissible under Islam. Indonesia is the world's largest Muslim-majority country and it plans to launch vaccinations of China's Sinovac Biotech on January 13th. But a health official said the government would first wait for a decision from the Indonesian Ulama Council, or MUI. Muti Ariantawati is the director of the Global Halal Center. Every Muslim should consume halal products and avoid those that are haram. And certainly it doesn't only apply to food and drinks, but also medicine. Indonesia is struggling with the worst COVID-19 outbreak in Southeast Asia. The New York Times reported that Sinovac told Indonesia's state-owned drug maker, Biopharma, that the vaccines were manufactured without porcine materials that come from pigs. Biopharma's corporate secretary confirmed receiving the statement, but said the halal status was decided by MUI. Some Muslims, like this resident, believe that it is okay to consume non-halal products in emergency situations. I am a Muslim, but due to the fact that this is an emergency situation, I'm fine with it because it is for the good of many people. It's better to use the vaccine to avoid having more victims. Indonesia's Food and Drug Agency need to issue emergency use approval for vaccinations to start. But controversy over whether vaccinations adhere to Islamic principles has hindered public health responses in the past. In 2018, the MUI issued a fatwa declaring that a measles vaccine was forbidden under Islam. President Joko Widodo has said he will be the first to receive the vaccine shot next week in a bid to boost acceptance.